The continuing history of FM 104, the home of 4 Triple M FM. Triple M FM, all day today with the Beatles A to Z. Every Beatles record in alphabetical order and in stereo. A full list of all records we're featuring are listed in the Sunday Sun. And there's more of the music you've asked us to play in Rod Lockington's Lunchbox each weekday. I'm moving along with Triple M Welcome to a journey that will take you to some of the biggest and best promotions ever staged on Australian radio. Our ride commences now. Four Triple M FM goes to air in 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. 16th of August 1930. And Brisbane gets its first commercial AM radio station, 4BC. 22nd of August 1980, and Brisbane has a new commercial radio station. 4 Triple M FM is on the air. Four Triple M FM. At 104 on the FM dial. From the movie Xanadu, ELO, all over the world. It's 17 past four. Four Triple M FM will succeed, it will flourish, and it will prosper. Triple M FM after the light is gone before that George Benson and the start of the set was Steve Forbes. Four Triple M was launched just nine weeks ago, and eight of its nine weeks on air have been in a rating survey period. The station has grabbed 6.9 per cent of the Brisbane radio audience, with significant penetration in the 10 to 17, 18 to 24, and 25 to 39 age groups. Here's Rob Mackay, the station manager. Uh, we uh, expected probably around about 4 or 5 per cent. Uh, I think um, getting 7 per cent is um, it's just phenomenal and I'm still floating on cloud nine. Uh, I would probably think that it wouldn't be too far away before we see another commercial FM station on the band and we would certainly welcome it um, because it would certainly give people uh, an option when they come to the FM band if they don't really like us uh, they can at least move to the other station on the FM band uh, without moving back off the FM band to AM. Here's the first 4 Triple M on air team. Rod Lockington, David Bond, Wayne Hunt, Bill Reiner, Ian Shaw Smith, Phil Moroni and sitting down at the front there is Marty Turpin. Later on the continuing history of FM 104. And Bob, Bob one day, when I didn't turn up. 